Friday. Finally Friday. <clears throat> Whew, I'm ready for it. Yes. Well, that's a cool looking box. So we just went and picked that one up yesterday. He is brand new, limited edition, of course. He's our MSC5, C4. Oh, that's cool. Looks pretty neat. We think so. Had a lot of people, they were like, oh, well, if it had a catfish on it, I would have bought it. I'm like, <laughs> a catfish. I've lived around here my whole life, fished, yeah. you know. I have never once seen a catfish come up out of the water unprovoked without yeah. being, you know, on a hook, you know. Mm -mm. Like, uh, you know, at our lake, we feed our fish, you know, and they'll just come up this just barely be. Yeah. Their lips be out of the water pretty much. But, yeah, I've never seen a catfish jump. No. So, and then another guy said, well, if it had a crappie on there, and I'm like, I can get you a marker, and you can doodle however you want to on there if you want. <laughs> Can't make nobody happy, can you? But they said that's one of the best designs they've seen, you know, that yeah. looks like that. It is that. cool, yeah. I think so. And if you look kind of down at the bottom, like there's actually more fish down there. Oh, yeah. It's like under the water level. Yeah. I see. It. That's cool. I yeah. didn't even notice that. Yeah. So you yeah. have different kind of fish down there. There you go. I'm not no <laughs> person that knows Fish you. expert. <laughs> I know how to bait the hook and throw it out and catch whatever bites. So. That's it. That's I'm good it. at catching them and eating them. So you could use it as a toolbox if you wanted to, or heck, I mean, if you have a bunch of fish and stuff. There you go. That'd be a huge tackle I'm, box, right? Exactly. Now. I'm not gonna judge you. <laughs> you just here to sell it, right? Exactly. Oh yeah, that's good. But uh, that's one of our new items today. That's cool. I like it. We thought it was pretty neat. A lot of people's already sold theirs. Like they mm -hmm. put it on the truck, and it was gone. Like I said, our guys were like, "Well, if it was this one or this one," so. Right but this is only the second day riding it. So who's can't, to know, it might not be here next week. Can't make everybody happy. Nope. Uh, did we show the headlight last week? No, but I actually watched the Instagram reel this morning showing the new one versus the old one and it was pretty cool. Yes. The brightness so, levels of it and stuff. Pretty neat. We have ours on a hat yep. to just kind of demo it because a lot of people just kind of had it stretched out and like, mm. my head's not that big. I'm like, well, somebody's been playing with it. So, it's pretty neat so you know it has the new leds on there right. and then it has the dual lights on the side and a lot of people didn't know that you had to press that sensor button so on the top you have two buttons so the first button cuts it on of course because if you can look it actually has a power button right so you click it on there i don't want to blind you and then the second button is your sensor mm -hmm. so cuts it off cuts it back on got grease all over my hands and yep. I don't want to touch my head or my light. So the new one, I think the reel I watched this morning, the old one was like 350 lumens. The yes. new one's 500. And yes, it is 500. So that one's got like three LED strips versus yes. the one in the old ones. So, so this cool. one, that's the high. Yeah. So you can tell it's pretty bright. And then that's, you know, dim, now right. in stars. And then, of course, you have yours on the side. Mm -hmm. Then off. But yes. So yeah, a lot yeah, of people yeah, like yeah. the fact that it is, you know, it's two different shades. Right. Give me just a second. Okay. My little boy just called. You got it. <laughs> we have a four year old who is obsessed with being on FaceTime. So oh, yeah. our customers know all about it. I'll have the phone sitting up there and they're like, oh, is he on there? I'm like, <laughs> flip it around. So like, yeah, here he is. <laughs> Well, that's cool. Yes. Yeah, the new light's pretty interesting. One of the things, um, I can't remember some of the questions, but somebody asked about some tools, and I don't remember which one it was in the comments last, it was a couple of times, and I actually forgot yes. it each time, and I forgot it again. But somebody else was asking about those safety glasses, and I just remembered seeing them there. But there was one like you wadded up and they didn't break. Now these, I don't know about wadding them up. Yeah, but you being can up, like, yeah, I like that. I mean, you can bend them all to pieces, and like he told us at demoing it, that is crazy that that doesn't is, break. 
and then of course you don't have your line there but um we sell a lot of these to anybody that just wants a cheap pair of sunglasses yeah the tinted ones now we sell a ton of clear ones to like we sold two or three pair to like a sawmill in uh -huh. Corinth. I mean, See, my problem is when I had safety glasses, a lot of times I would like hang the ear over my back pocket. Well, you know, and then you would lean up against something and you'd crack on them and all right, that kind of so stuff. I'm trying to find something to hang it on, but I ain't got nothing. So let's just, if you had it right. hooked over your pocket, that I is mean, crazy that those let's say you're break. sitting on them. <laughs> that is absolutely insane. It's pretty nice. And then they just go back to normal. Just... That's crazy. But I will tell you, we have people get on here. They're like, oh, we're all love them that way. These are not. Yeah. So, so don't... before you get on your <laughs> truck, <Don't do> it. <laughs> make sure that they are. Because I had a guy, I had one guy holding a pair like this. Now, these are new that's up there. And he was just bending them everywhere. And, I, and the other guy's like, oh, I want to try oh, these. And I'm like, it. don't do that. But did yes. he break them? No, he didn't. Oh. I caught him in time because I seen what he was doing, and I was like, "No, grab the ones down below it." Right. So just the red and the blue pair does that. Yes. Oh, we. I said, no, we sold. We had a whole bag of them, and we've just been filling it as they sell. Yeah. We're down to one other pair, wow, and we that's have a crazy. bunch of other ones on order. So they're nice. Um, like I said, a lot of people use them as sunglasses. Mm -hmm. We got a lot of people that ride motorcycles, especially now that's warming up. Oh, yeah, They'll that would wear be the good clear ones. Yeah. They actually, we have a guy that has two pair. He has his clear pair for night and he has mm -hmm. his other one for the daytime. He's like, those are just the easiest ones. I can just throw them in my bag and I don't sure. have to worry about, you know. So we're like, okay. So whatever your preference is, we don't care. <laughs> well, that's pretty cool. <laughs> yeah, it's it's but, nice. But uh, I was trying to like think of something like else. That. that is really neat. Yeah. So. And if you're curious about looking at all the different styles they have, I think that their part number starts with a FF. Okay. So if you get on the Maco catalog, whether it be online or uh, in your app, because if you do it through the app, I know that you can submit it to your distributor if you have a distributor mm -hmm. that you're logged into. Um, our guys, they like to use it, but getting off track, it's the part number starts FF. Okay. So click it, and then it should pull up everything that starts with an F. <laughs> that might be a lot. But first off, it's going to be those glasses. Click on what pair you like. As long as it says Force Flex on it, it's mm -hmm. going to be bendable. If it says anything other than that, Don't I would double it. check. Yeah, I would, it. Yeah, I'd double check <laughs> before I bend it. There but, you go. Uh, yeah, our guys, they'll get on there, and anything that they see, they'll click it, and they'll submit it to us. And then we'll either pull it, like if somebody wanted those, we'll pull it off the shelf and stick it back for them or nice. if we don't we just you know go ahead and have it on the way for them a lot okay. of people like it but well awesome good yeah. stuff today try to all right guys like always thanks for hanging out with us if you like the video hit that thumbs up check over here for merchandise cool tools and discount codes down here it's finally friday enjoy your weekend if you're not subscribed click that button y'all have a great one see ya